Hi everyone! In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can migrate your shop from Shopify into your WordPress. So let's say that at some point you don't really want to use Shopify as your store anymore or you just want to expand your store so that you have two websites instead of your one. You want to work on Shopify as well as on WordPress. But you don't really want to do everything from scratch you just want everything to be moved automatically you can do that by the helps of app on shopify or plugins on wordpress now before we continue i will have to tell you some important things and first is that you will have to subscribe either to shopify as well as to WordPress in order to make this happen. So as you know, you actually will have to pay for some pricing. At least you will have to be on the basic plan of Shopify. I'm going to try and show you all of the plans that Shopify have. So I'm currently on basic plan and you will be able to pay for a dollar for the first three months, which is I think it's a steal which is very cheap if you want to take a look at how things will work with Shopify and then after the first three months you will have to pay for around $19 and then they have the Shopify plans which start at $49 after the first three months again you can also only pay $1 for the first three months and as for the advance you will have to pay $2.99 after the first three months and here are the benefits of each plan you can always pause the video if you will want to see on each plan's benefit you can go ahead and do so and basically in order to be able to migrate your shopify to your wordpress you will have to pay for at least the basic plan they do give you some free trials if you're new I think it was for around a month or something they're going to give you a free trial just so that you will know how Shopify will operate but it's still going to be limited you will not be able to access the full features so you can try that first if you want but if you already but if you're serious about Shopify and you will want to build your website you can totally go with the basic plans first and second you will have to also upgrade your plan on wordpress so wordpress have this pricing plans called creator and here are the price for the creator plan and in order to add plugins or it's sort of like an app on shopify in order to add plugins you will have to upgrade your account to the creator one but they do give you a free trials they will give you seven days free trials in which I am trying out right now. And as you can see, I have five days left or for my free trials. But with this free trials, I'll be able to enjoy the benefit that I can get if I'm upgrading my plan into the creator plan. So now that I got the important things out, I can finally start and show you how you can migrate your shopify store into your wordpress first you will want to go to plugin and then over here the plugins that we're going to use is going to be all in one wp go ahead and click on it and this is the one that we're searching for it's going to be all in one wp migration and if you click on it, it says that we can move, transfer, copy, migrate, and backup a site with one click, quick, easy, and reliable. So you can go ahead and click install and active. Now that we got our plugin activated, we're going to want to click on manage plugin. And here we'll be able to see on all of the plugins that we currently have. So this is the one that we just activated. I'm going to go ahead and click on view details. And here you'll be able to see on the overall details of your plugin. So after you see that your all-in-one WP migrations is installed once, you're going to 
want to go back to your navigations bar on the left side of your screen and if you scroll down you will find this all-in-one wp migrations options and then you can go ahead and click on import and here you'll be able to import your site and you can choose whether you want it to be in the form of file url ftp dropbox google drive amazon s3 OneDrive, etc. As you can see, there is a lot of selections that you can choose. So you can choose from any of these selections. Usually the easiest way we can do it is obviously by using URL, but in order to do that, you will have to pay a yearly license so that you can migrate your shop in a URL form. But basically, all you have to do if you pay for the yearly license is to copy the domain on your Shopify and you can get your domain by clicking on settings. And then you will find this domains options right here. Click on your domain and then you're going to be able to copy on this domain and put it into your plugins right here and then WordPress is going to automatically import your Shopify store into your WordPress website. The second way for you to do that is by using an app on Shopify. Go ahead to the app sections and then you're going to want to type in migrate. And then you're going to be brought into Shopify app stores and you'll be able to find a lot of selections of application that will allows you to migrate your stores into another website so this lead extension store migration is one of them so this app is going to make it easier for you to transfer various types of data product categories customer order reviews cms pages blog posts urls password etc for your online store to shopify so you can choose this app in order to migrate your store to wordpress or maybe you can also try to find export your store and it's going to show you all of the apps that you can use to export your store beside the app that I've just shown you earlier. Or you can also import your site in the form of maybe a file. So this one doesn't really need any other extensions to it. So you can maybe download this apps right here, which is going to allows you to edit your product in bulk mode directly from Google Sheets. So this app is going to be able to connect your store to Google and it's going to create a sheets filled in with the product on your store and it's going to basically turn your stores into a file and then you can just upload it to WordPress and that's it. Your store can basically migrate from Shopify into your WordPress. And that's basically it. That is how you can migrate your store from Shopify to WordPress. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.